I think having a partner that really understands the career path that you're trying to pursue um, and is flexible and, and try and as a couple being flexible it's not always at the same point the opportunities are equal but willing to trust each other that this may be, be a better opportunity for Paul at one point or for me at another point but as a whole recognizing that we were both really supporting each other's career and I think that's probably what has succeeded for us. Absolutely, I, I agree with that. <laughs> you know, and he always begins with, I don't want to give you advice. And then, I don't want to give you advice, but. Okay. Well, I don't want to give you advice, but. So, um, you don't need this. I, 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 would, I would say mo most deans who have come from chair positions, the biggest transition is, is being an institutional thing. And that's, that's the hardest transition. You have always been an institutional thinker, so that's not going to be your transition. My advice to you is I'm going to give you the advice I gave you in our last walk, which is uh, you can't do everything yourself, and you need someone, or particularly around communications, because one of, one of uh, your great strengths is you're one of the great communicators. When you stand up and talk, people are inspired and all that. I mean, I, I, I just love to watch you talk. But you're going to have to have other people uh, mess In fact, just yeah, so you know that I well. listened to my husband's advice. Um, my first hire when I became chair was a director of communications. But I like to say I take Paul's all, all his good <laughs> ideas and I learn from his bad ones. And she does. <laughs> She's never implemented my bad ones. <laughs> I avoid his mistakes. Yeah, that's unfortunately true. Advice I would give my husband now in his seventh year of being executive <laughs> dean, uh, keep doing what you're doing. All right. I mean, I, what I have learned from Paul is how you grow in leadership. And you can be very senior and still grow in leadership. And he has. I mean, it's been amazing. I don't, I don't think either one of us thought I'd be able to I thought you'd pull it off, but I, I'm constantly impressed with how he navigates um, Texas, Texas, and a complex system. Yeah. So I would say I'm just really proud of him. Thank you.